Hey, Kinnick, new developments this morning on the crash into Topolis that spilled anhydrous ammonia, leading to the death of five people in September. It happened when a semi carrying over 7,000 gallons of the fertilizer crashed after a vehicle tried to pass it in a no passing zone. The semi drove into a ditch to avoid two cars from crashing head on, but the accident caused anhydrous ammonia to leak from that semi. And now we're learning that several lawsuits have been filed by families of those victims. And our Julia Rosier has more on the lawsuits and brings us an update this morning. In each of the court documents we received, the defendants are the same. They are listed as Prairie Land Transport, Jacob Blomker, and Haley Case. Through the documents, we learned that Blomker was the driver of the tractor trailer carrying the anhydrous ammonia, and Case was driving the vehicle behind the tractor trailer that was trying to pass it. Out of the six cases we received, four cases were filed on behalf of people who died, and two were filed by people who were injured or were exposed to the anhydrous ammonia. In each of the cases, all of the charges are similar. They range from negligence, wrong death, wanton conduct to respondent superior charges. The wanton conduct charge accused the defendant of the conscious or intentional disregard to the rights and safety of others, and the respondent superior charge can hold an employer legally responsible for the wrongful acts of an employee. I went through each of the documents we received. Across all of the cases, we found that there are 24 total charges against Prairie Land Transport, 16 total against the driver, and 12 total against Case. Now, thank you, Julia. We are still waiting on those documents in the seventh lawsuit. More information on the cases is up right now on our website, newschannel20.com. Thanks for watching. Stick around by subscribing today and don't miss a single video.